Welcome back everybody. Today's a great day. I got my new windshield uh, seal and I'm almost done with getting the flange and brace reinstalled in the car. Uh, I shot some videos of uh, welding it in, trying to fit it in and uh, figured we could have a look at this uh, windshield seal. I actually picked up the one for the rear window as well and hopefully uh, Hopefully everything goes well with getting the car fixed because as soon as that uh, windshield is done I can start putting the front end back on the car and you know eventually get the dash back in and uh, that's going to be a pretty good finish for all the structure in the car and I only have a few things left to do on the body just to uh, get it prepared for you know, body work. So let's have a look. I guess they packed it real good for me. Holy moly. There it is. Looks like I'm going to hit you. So this one, that's the rear window. Alright. Well, because my car didn't have any chrome, I just got the, the no groove gasket. Get twisted here. This was going to be a jigsaw puzzle. Okay. Man, this looks fantastic. Hmm. Yep, it looks pretty good. Not really much to see on it other than the fact that it holds my window. Nice, uh, Groove for that. Hopefully, I can uh, get the windshield back in the car. So that means I'm going to have to do a little bit of body work and uh, paint it, and then I'll maybe stick the windshield back in. Uh, and then when I go to paint the car, I'll just tape it up. I guess I really don't want to do it that way, but just for time and effort, it. Uh, yeah, we'll see. All right. So watch some clips. Enjoy, and thanks for coming back. Uh, I know it's taken me a bit to uh, get back to making the videos, uh, but uh, yeah, a few life things have happened, and uh, it's been slowing down. Right in the middle of renovating my bathroom, which has been a real pain in the ass. Uh, I'll tell you right now, if you ever do tile, never, ever, ever use pre-mixed grout. It's an epoxy-based, and it sticks to the tile, so... One warning for you, if you ever do tile, the only way to get this stuff off is to actually use acetone, and it sucked. So, my advice to you, it's about the only thing you're going to learn from me. Alright guys, uh, enjoy, and I'll see you in the end.
as you can see, I got a little bit more left to do. I fixed up this area down here. I've still got a hole here. Got to weld that flange up a little bit more. Um, the brace is probably a little bit longer than the flange that I installed here. So I'm just going to leave that because I know it's probably going to need it. I'm going to test fit that gasket and make sure it's not, uh, not doing anything funky. A uh, little bit of grinding to do on the back side here, clean up these welds. And hopefully, uh, hopefully I can have this sorted in the next couple days. Here's the other side. Don't have the the flange in yet or the uh, the brace. Uh, still quite a bit of work to do there. But I wanted to get this video out just so I could at least show you where it's at. Proper windy day. Thought it was going to be nice and warm and sunny, but no. Well, we got the wind. All right. So I didn't really want to do it this way, uh, like I showed in the video, it, uh, it was a mangled mess. The brace actually came out of a 40, uh, 50 Ford four-door that was used in a movie and they dropped a tree on it. Uh, so uh, I bought this part off of a guy who cut the roof off his car and put it on the four-door because it was in better shape than his. So. Um, yeah, I was really struggling to put it in because I really don't know how the uh, brace sat because the one that was in here was completely gone. So I'm really, uh, really have no idea. I'm kind of hoping to get some photos uh, sent to me and I can figure this out. Uh, but yeah, so I did cut it in half. I got the other piece here. It's ready to go in. Uh, you know, and it's the reason being is this was the hard part trying to get it in this spot you know and yeah it's probably not going to be right but you know what if the window fits and the window doesn't leak I don't care because nobody's going to see this once the headliner's in so yeah I think we're doing all right all right hey welcome back so, you know, we're pretty close to finishing up, and once I do, uh, it's going to feel like it's fast and furious getting this car put back together, at least the front end. I'd like to see the, uh, the headlights on this car again. Kind of sick of looking at the, the front clip, wishing I could still see the front end of my car. So, all right, guys, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time. Later.